up, Mac Buck Road Loggers. Here we are, Livering Firewood today. I'm gonna double check something before I get too far here. Yeah, I drove off without closing the pinnel. <laughs> oh well. True story, I spent an entire day once delivering firewood with the wrong size ball on the hitch. I had a one and seven, I had the smaller size ball compared to the bigger ball. And I was wondering all day why everything was being all, you know, wonky. It was pretty bad. There are officers everywhere today. It's the rain, man, I don't operate so good in this stuff. Makes you want to stay home where it's warm, cozy, dry. I'm losing my stuff. I had a couple of good opportunities to go and I'm stuck here. All because I keep hearing weird stuff coming from the back, man. That's the problem with the pinnel hitch. Make noises you're not used to. back and forth and back and forth to try to figure out where this house was, right? Finally figure out where it is, seeing some crazy lady out in the woods feeding her chickens and uh, knowing where it is. And it's a house that's abandoned, there's no power, the windows are boarded up, there's about 200 hypodermic needles littered all over the driveway. And I didn't see anybody home, so I turned around and left. I'm not about to get jumped, robbed, or any of that kind of nonsense. I am, I am fully good on that. I mean, I'm a country boy. I don't care about this modern city nonsense with druggies that are trying to rob people. So, can't get a hold of anybody at the landing. Nobody met me at the door with cash in hand, so I'm taking the wood home, man. I'm not dumping it there. I don't mind the gas. Just five, ten bucks out of my pocket. Well, made it back from landing and loaded up with a different delivery. And I'm kind of glad I didn't sit around waiting because the guy wasn't even there. It was a really sketchy situation. Glad I turned around and left, because who knows what could happen. These days and age, man, people are desperate. Who knows what they'll do. Hasn't been a good start to the weekend already. Just hope everything is looking up from here. I guess that's one way to see it. Things have already gone to hell, so in a hand basket, whatever that means. It can only get better, right?
about it, okay? <laughs> well, you don't hear about it. Never. <laughs> hear all about it. <laughs> Why are you so mean to me? I want to help. Yeah. Oh, God. oh, come on, dude. That was bullshit. Timmy, you missed. No, I didn't. It just fell out of place. <laughs> Timmy, you missed. That's offensive, Scotty. Is it? <laughs> yeah, that one was that mile over, too. God fuck. Yeah. Well, in general, it turned out to be a pretty good weekend. We got some firewood orders filled, got some logs cut up, got a lot of split done. Had a good time hanging out with each other. And, you know, we were tired and hungry at the end of the day, and that's all I can ask for. So if you like our kind of content, do us a big favor, throw us a sub, maybe even give us a thumbs up. We'll see you next week. This is Mark Road Lauders. <laughs>